Okay, okay. First of all, let me start by saying I am a Sony fanboy. Normally, I always buy PlayStation first, and then other systems I'll get if a certain game comes out for it that I like. Um, I've been a Sony fanboy ever since PlayStation 1, and I just gotta say it. Nintendo won this E3, you guys. Like the, I As much as I don't really like to say it, but I can't really fight the inevitable. I mean just the news that these guys announced like they got a new xenoblade chronicles uh sequel coming out they got a uh, freaking pokemon rpg on the switch like the first time since the pokemon coliseum gale of darkness games which weren't even technically rpgs and now that i say that i hope this one isn't like that neither but it could be it's the very first like mainline pokemon game on a console that right there is big as hell. And then they got Metroid Prime 4, a game that people have been waiting like 10 years for. Um, man, I remember uh, just messing with that when it first came out for Dream, or for the, yeah, Dream, not Dreamcast, the GameCube. Like that stuff, it was one of the very first games I remember seeing my friends play. And then I went out and got it after I got my GameCube way after the fact. Um, it's funny, just a quick side note. I bought my GameCube for a Zoids game. I imported it from Japan. It was a Zoids game. That's the whole reason that I got a GameCube. So let that be a, a sign that it don't really take too much for me to try to get a console. It just has to be a game about either a franchise or something like that I'm interested in. And it looks interesting. I will go ahead and pick it up. But yeah, Nintendo has just knocked this completely out of the ballpark. Just with those announcements. And then they got a new trailer for Super Mario Odyssey. Um, I'm going to go ahead and check that out. Let's see what they have to offer. Try to get right into it because so far this video has been going on long enough. Let's go. T Rex. Oh shit, and a realistic one at that. Well, not really realistic, but a Jurassic Park T-Rex, let's put it that way. If they had feathers and everything else, it probably wouldn't be all that recognizable to some people. I'm liking the music too. It has that club band feel to it. A little bit of uh, little bit of Easter eggs with the old school Mario. Mario is Captain Ginyu. Oh, so you can put that cinnamon in And they immediately grow facial hair as soon as he touches them. How does fire get facial hair? No idea. But Mario can get it done. At this point, I'm thinking that Peach is just trying to be with Bowser, but Mario just keeps on foiling her plans because she didn't got in a wedding dress and everything. Mario is the the stalker boyfriend that just won't let it go. It's just the narrative making you think that he's the good guy. If you could be a T-Rex. The game will never end as far as I'm concerned. Like that right there, I will always be the T-Rex on every level. And I think that was Pauline singing. It could have been. And it looks like the game's coming out this year, so that's October 27th of this year. As long as they don't get pushed back or nothing like that, it seems like it would be pretty cool. Um, oh yeah, they also announced a new Kirby game. They announced a new Yoshi game, which looks a lot like um, the... Super Mario World 2 Yoshi's uh what was it, Yoshi's Island? I don't know why the name of it is like on the tip of my tongue. I f it's like I forgot the name of that game. 
I think it was Yoshi's Island. And they got a, uh, what was it, a Mario and Rabbits game. That looks like it's a tactics type of game. That like it could be kind of fun. Um, hmm, what's this? I haven't seen this. Look like um, Mario and Luigi Superstar Saga plus Bowser's Minions. I'm not sure how how recent that video is, but looks like it could be another um, Mario RPG game, which you know always is great. Like, Last time I checked, they were having one where they combined the Mario and Luigi saga with the Paper Mario saga, so I'm still waiting to see more on that, but looks like they got a new Mario and Luigi game coming out. Um, anyway, that's been this video. It's gone on long enough. Um, again, Nintendo won. Uh, come on, Sony fanboys, Xbox fanboys. You, we got to give it up for them. I mean, I mean come on now. We, we got to just face facts and give credit where credit's due. They won this E3. Um, anyway, that's been this video. Um, if you like this video, make sure you like, comment, and subscribe. Uh, be sure to share these videos. I keep forgetting, or at least always slip my mind to mention that. And that's it. So um, I think that's all the videos I'm going to react to today. Um, so I will see you guys on the next upload. Peace.